Hi, are you a recent graduate or do you have one in your home that's a recent graduate? One of your kids recently graduated from college? Well, I'm Judy Heff, financial concierge, bookkeeper to highly successful individuals. And I have a few tips I wanna give you today that you can share with your graduate or if you're the graduate, maybe you can listen to them and figure some things out. So I think the first thing that's really a great idea is to get a spending plan together. You could call it a budget. I like to call it a spending plan. I think it just sounds a lot less daunting. So get a spending plan together and see what your expenses are gonna be. Are you still living at home with mom and dad? Or are you able to get an apartment? Do you need to figure out what your rent's gonna be, your utilities, your cell phone, if you have a car, or car insurance or commuting costs? And figure all of that out and put it down on paper and see what your income's gonna be and what your expenses are and then Try to figure out how to pay yourself first. I think that's the most important thing. Pay yourself first and save a little bit for emergencies. So that's a good way to start. So your student loans are gonna be due about six months from when you graduate. And if you don't have a job, that's gonna be a problem. So I think it's really important to get those student loans organized and paid and see what you can do. And if you're not getting a job right away, if it's gonna take you a little longer to get a job, then I would see if you can renegotiate some of those terms. And then the other thing you wanna do is build your credit very slowly. So don't go into debt trying to build your credit and just charge what you can and pay it off right away. Pay it off in full when the credit card comes because you wanna make sure that you have a good credit score. And you don't wanna be paying high interest on something you think you're getting a bargain on. And if you can't afford it, don't buy it. It's as simple as that. So, you know, never miss a payment, stay on time and start saving. Start saving, start putting money away from that emergency fund. And if you get a job that has benefits, take that free money. If they're willing to match what you're gonna put in your 401k, then take that because that's free money and what's wrong with free money. So get organized, try to get your spending plan together and get ready to get out into the world and face those challenges. Judy Heff, JudithHeff.com financial concierge.